So a friend of mine the other day showed me something, well, kind of handy from a photographer point of view. And what it was, I do a lot of club photography and I wanted a way to put my link to my website and all the images that will go onto the photography site um, so that people who see me working there who wanted other types of photos could go to my website and see the other work that I do. Um, but I didn't want to add that to each image individual. I didn't know how to do it because if you do it in Facebook, um, you need to go into, into each individual description and add it to the photo and it's time consuming. And I thought, well, there must be a way within Photoshop to do it to all the images in one go and not have all the hassle. And just as a thought, as a, a friend showed me, there is a way to do that. And I thought, well, I'll share that on to you guys through the YouTube channel. So that's what I'm going to show you just now. So I've got a photo at the moment of one of my kids. And to add the information to it, it's actually really easy. What you do is go to File and File Info. And on the very first screen for the description is the copyright status that you're looking for. Now, you can change it to unknown, copyrighted, public domain, but it's in here, the copyright notice, that you want to put the information surrounding the, the website itself. So if we do, as an example, uh, I'll add my copyright, which on the iMac keyboard is Alt and G. So copyright and we'll just put D. In fact, we'll put the name, which is All About You Photography. And it will be... And that's it. Now, if I wanted to, I could save that through export to make it into a metadata, which I can then add to all images. And that way I can add an action. Um, and I think I've done a video on actions previously. If not, I'll be putting one up soon. Um, but you can then create an action so that you can select a folder and it will drive every in image in and it will then add the, the metadata information to each image image for you and save it automatically so you're not having to do it every time yourself so that's all there there is to that once you then upload the information to the the website if i'll show you now i've done one for harlem now i'm not sure if you need the http bit at the start but it's worth adding in just in case now i've added the copyright information url on there as well I did it first time and just put that in and it didn't work. It needs to go in the description box here. Um, and then it creates a link on Facebook which then directs to your page. And that's all you need to do to have a link added to every single image you put up on Facebook, whether it be your own personal page or if you've got a photography page on there. I'm not sure how it works on other sites, you know, such as you know Twitter or um, LinkedIn or anything like that. But try it, you might find it, it works fine. Thanks for watching, guys.